Hi, thank you for joining me today. My name is Stacy, and this is Stacy Lee Beauty, and I put out new beauty related videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So if you are new here, welcome. I hope that you will stick around. And if you are returning, thanks for coming on back and watching my videos. Today, I wanna talk about 111 Skin. So this is the Rose Gold Radiance Booster. This was in my FabFitFun spring box. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it up above and down below. This is over $100. So yeah, pretty pricey. And I thought as I was testing it out, you will see in the coming clips, I tested it directly on my skin, mixed in with moisturizer. And I liked it. It did make a little bit of a difference. But with that price tag, I thought, mm, is there anything cheaper that could come a little close that I could find? And I have this is Telex Organic, and this is the Rose Quartz Hydra Glow. And again, I did a video on this. I will link that up above as well and down below if you want to see that and the cool packaging it comes in. But that's besides the point. But I thought, well, this is Rose Quartz and this is Rose Gold. You know, could this be a dupe for it? How does it work? So if you want to see how it looks and what my thoughts are, Keep on watching. Half of my face with just regular moisturizer, the Paracone, and the other half of my face with this 111 Skin mixed into the moisturizer. It says that you can either put this with your moisturizer or just directly on your I'm skin. I'm using the Paracone MD Face Finishing and Firming Moisturizer. This is one of my favorites. I like to put it on the back of my hand and then put it on. Let's add a little bit more, and we're going to mix the 111 skin in with it. It says one to two drops. So I guess it's that. One, two. And I use my little spatula, mix it around. See here if I look up close is there a difference this side has the 111 mixed in with moisturizer and this side does not actually this side does I feel like look more hydrated I guess actually I can definitely see a difference well I would think for that price tag right around here you can really see the difference so 111 skin mixed in and not so yeah I feel like it definitely does add some dewiness and radiance and moisture to the skin. What do you think? Let me know. Again, this side has it mixed in and this side does not. Okay, so I'm currently trying out a new hair curling device. So while I'm waiting for the curls to set, I figured I'll go ahead and put on some moisturizer. So I'm not sure if this video is an as seen on TV. I'm not sure which video is gonna go first, but if this one already is, then I will link that down below. So now we're gonna try it just directly on the skin. Okay, so I'm just going to put it here. One, two. That might have been a little much because now I realize that was probably for your whole face, but now let's put the Paracone moisturizer on. I have 111 skin on this side, just that without moisturizer first. And this is just the Paracone. Let's put moisturizer on top of that. Does one side look better than the other? I think they're pretty similar. I do think, however, this side with the 111 first is a little bit more hydrated and dewy looking. I think that I kind of like it. I'm pretty sure mixed in with the moisturizer. I feel like that kind of gave, I mean, I'm having some luminosity and brightening but I, I kind of like it that way better. So we have determined so far that when you add the 111 Skin Booster Serum to moisturizer, that it definitely does give a dewy finish, more hydrated. I'm gonna do one side of the face with one and the other with the okay. other. I'll put both of them directly on the skin and then moisturize and see how it goes. So 
They feel about the same on each side as far as how they feel when I have them on. It does look like the 111 skin is just kind of a little bit more. There's like kind of um, look closely like right here. I want to say like a little bit of like gold flecks or something. Can you see that? I'm not sure if you can see it right there. And if you look right here. So there's like a little bit more just kind of a different texture but a little bit more sparkle over here. And if you look at my forehead over here, there's a little bit more of a glow or kind of shimmer, but I feel like they're pretty close. Let me know what you think. I feel like it's really close for how hydrated they look. So it is quite the difference of a price tag. So yeah, I'd say if you want to kind of get this glow as the 111, you know, the kind of that hydrating, glowy, dewy feel, but don't want to spend the price tag, I would say check out Talix Organics. It, I think, is a good, this still isn't drugstore, but it is much cheaper than that. And I think it gives a good, you know, hydration glow to the skin. I will have a link for both of these down below if you want to see. But yeah, that's my thoughts. So I'd love to know if you have tried either one of these and from watching the video, which do you think? Do you think that this is a good dupe for it or not? And if you enjoyed this video and you're not already subscribed, I hope that you will click the subscribe button down below. It is free and hit the little notification bell. That way you don't miss any of my videos. I'd also love to hear from you and leave a comment down below. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time.